My father passed away in 2007 from hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, which is a genetic disease that my brother and I each stand a 50% chance of developing later on in life. And so what I'm doing is trying to get into elementary schools and educate kids on the importance of living healthy, active lives and also work with some Girl Scout troops. What most people don't realize is that heart disease is the number one cause of death in the United States for both men and women. More women will die from heart disease than all of the cancers combined. Since being at the Texas Heart Institute over the last couple of days, it has really opened my eyes to the research being done and the advancements being made in medicine today meeting with doctors and researchers here, it has just filled me with so much hope to know that the disease that took my father's life nine years ago today could be prevented. They are doing breakthrough research on the sudden prevention of sudden cardiac death in the young. I really do hope to become a pediatric cardiologist. I had a great pediatric cardiologist growing up and I remember the very first time I walked into his office, I was scared out of my mind and he just had this sense of peace that he gave me and left me with and he always filled me with hope and I want to be able to do that one day for other children. As Miss Capital City, I have been able to promote my platform now in three different states, Texas, Mississippi, and Tennessee. It is so important to me to have a national stage to get to educate kids on the importance of having a healthy heart because a healthy heart will lead to a happy life. Project Heart with the Girl Scout troops, they earn a badge, which is a big incentive, but what they're doing is they are learning heart-related um, facts and things that can keep them healthy in the long run. Ultimately, I really hope that kids do understand the importance of how they're treating their bodies now and how that will affect their futures, mainly because one in three children and teens in the United States today are obese, and being obese as a child leads to a 60% chance of developing heart disease in the future. Something that just is so important to me is just knowing that they are aware of what they're doing to their body so that they can live a healthier lifestyle and start now making decisions that will benefit their future.